All right, what's good, everybody? I hope everybody's having a great Wednesday. We're here to do another pick a card reading. So in these pick a card, we're gonna do yes or no questions. So you're gonna ask your yes or no question, um, pick a card, I'm gonna pull three cards, and then we're gonna get the answer to your question. We're also gonna pull some tarot to see why that is your answer. All right, guys? So the timestamps for these readings are gonna be down below in the description box. Also, don't forget to like, sh share, subscribe if you haven't done so already. And if you just came to hate, hey, go ahead and do that, because either way I'm going to do me, you're going to continue to do you, and there's nothing I can do about that. All right, well, guys, um, don't forget, if they, not every detail of these readings are going to resonate, but if they do, you can um, feel free to check me out on Instagram, TikTok, Facebook. I'll put all the information for that stuff down below in the description box. Also, my email is down there, and you can email me for information about your own personal readings if you feel compelled to do so okay guys all right guys so go ahead and ask your question get your question and then I'm gonna pull three cards so you're gonna pick your card ask your question and then pick your card all right guys Timestamps will be down below. All right, so if you have your question and you picked your card, let's see what your answer is. So card number one is the full. The full is a yes. Card number two is a will of fortune. The will of fortune is a yes. And the third card is the justice. The justice is a yes. So all three cards are yes. All right, guys. So um, I will put the timestamps below and we're going to jump into card number one. All right. All right. Card number one. If you, if you got the full, your answer is a yes. So let's see what your, what your answer is in regards to and why it's a yes. Okay, we have uh, the Eight of Pentacles is talking about your work. If you've been juggling when it comes to work. Um, okay. Yeah, you're going to have the victory. You're going to have the victory. So, you know, you could have been maybe you've been out of work and you've been juggling maybe your finances good news is going to come in you're you know you're going to have the victory what's the two of pentacles let's see what you've been juggling okay we have the empress so you could be a mother um, your work situation, you've been juggling your finances, your work, and it's its leading to a tower moment. <clears throat> what is the tower? What's the tower? This could be an ending. We have the justice. This ending is going to rebalance the scales. Whatever it is that you've been juggling, this is, I'm not, I'm not getting that the tower is a bad thing as much as like, it's just, it's gonna bring in like some major changes because it's all majors right here. What is this change? It might, you might be relocating, you might be moving. I'm taking it as like, this is, this is where you're being led to. You might, yeah, you're being led, you, you like, you don't know. That's why you came out as the fool because it's requiring you to take a leap of faith. Right now you don't know 
what's coming in. It could be your living situation, your home life might be up in the air, but you're going to have a new passionate beginning somewhere else. lots of options on where you want to go. It's like once you make up your mind, you're going to go towards that. It might require you to stand your ground. <sighs> yeah, people, people are going to want you to be giving to them. You might be doing better financially. But I'm not seeing any pentacles, but the whole beginning was about your work and getting balanced in it. Wow. Somebody does not like that. Somebody wants to end that. They want to keep you in a state of lack and like penny pinching. You've been working on something. God. <clears throat> There's a lot of cards that flew out. There's a lot going on right now. <clears throat> you could have some people working against you. But the victory is going to be yours. Let's look at that three of cups. This is your community. Okay, so this is your, you know, your, your family, your group of friends, your co-workers. It could have been co-workers sabotaging you. It could have been your family. It could have been your friends. What's this three of cups? Yeah. You had lots of people working against you. Well, I don't know, maybe I won't say that just yet. Yeah. Yeah, okay. So, again, like I said, this could have been your, your community, right? Your friends. Could have been friend, friends. It could have been your partner. It could have been family. It, it, with the Three of Pentacles, it could have been coworkers. These people saw that you were going to have, if once you took that, that leap of faith, that your life was going to change drastically. And they wanted to end that. They wanted to end your wish fulfillment. They're getting caught trying to bring burdens to you. Okay, anything else for group one? What do I need to know? You're going to be stable financially. This is going to cause a lot of conflict. People want to come after you, you know, try to get some money after uh, from you. You're going to have to be level-headed and, you know, have clarity on who you can trust. Because you're going to have to cut some people out. Yeah, you're protecting your happiness. So in order to do that, you have to end things with these people. These are the people you're gonna have to cut cut out. But they're trying to act like everything's cool. 
like, oh, I'm not really trying to stab you in the back. They're trying to come off like they're loving. But they're not. They just want to get something out of you. Yeah, they want you to stay blindfolded. They don't want you to cut, <clears throat> um, cut them out. They want you to be blind. You've worked really hard for whatever you have. You've been very loving to these people, but it's time to finally end this, these connections, because these people aren't good for you. <sighs> yeah, you need to, you need to, yeah, you need to get clarity on who it is that you can call family, who it is you can call friends, you know. But it is, yes, you take a leap of faith. You might move. Whereas you could have been homeless, you could have been alone, abandoned. This move, taking this leap of faith, this move is gonna get take you out of this the situation I'm almost getting like you could be moving near water yeah this is something you've been wanting It might feel bittersweet, almost I'm getting like, you could, even though this is something you've wanted, you can feel defeated in this situation as well. Let's do it. Something that you had a lot of emotion for might have to come t to an end in order for you to go towards your you know this work opportunity okay spirit just put this through that even though it might feel it might feel defeating because something that you have a lot of emotion for is feeling like it's coming to an end. The truth is it's just the beginning. Something you're not seeing is that this new beginning is creating a whole new cycle for stability. So whatever you have to walk away from temporarily is only temporary. It's needed in order for you to, um, I wanna say rebuild a stronger foundation, if that makes any sense. It's like you have to walk away to do this in order to bring more st um, stability for whatever this is that you have a lot of emotion for. Yeah. Oh yeah, oh yeah. You're trying to create like a new... Um, almost like, I wanna, almost, I wanna say like build um, a stronger family, but again, there's a need to have to walk away temporarily, and that's why it's feeling so defeating, because you don't want to, but you know you have to. All right, guys, I think I'm going to leave that there. I hope this helped, and we're going to don't forget, guys, if um, you want your own personal reading, you can email me. I put that information down below in the description box. All right, guys. Um, yeah, so we're going to move on to group number two. All right, group number two. <laughs> okay, so you and you, whatever question you ask, your answer is yes with the will of fortune. So if you've been worried about whatever you is your will of fortune. <laughs> Um, I mean, it, it looks like it's going to come in. Oh my God. 
Okay. Yeah, you're just... <laughs> I'm getting you're very... You want to act impulsively. Because it's almost like you're not seeing what it is that you... You haven't seen it come in yet. So you're getting a little anxious, right? You're like, I've been working and working and working and I'm not seeing anything come of it. Spirit's here, like I'm here to tell you the truth. Okay, what's the truth, Spirit? getting you're gonna have money to go shopping <laughs> you're gonna be able to have enough money to give to others somebody could be coming and giving to you So you're still not sure, you're not seeing it, you're not seeing this come in, you're starting to become a little, you know, pessimistic, you're trying to act like everything's fine, you're just, you're, yeah, you're, you're not seeing it yet. So the cards are saying, yeah, it's coming, it's coming, but then you're, you're not seeing it. Somebody's coming in. We got the King of Pentacles. Oh. All right, so somebody could be coming in. <clears throat> this heartbreak this whatever's been stressing you out like the balance is going to be restored anything else so this could be love this could, yeah it could be love a love offer what else could be a love offer. Well, you guys might have a baby. <laughs> Lots of love offers coming in. Somebody could want to get you pregnant, so be careful if you don't want to have babies. Somebody could, you know, someone could want to have kids. So if you're not down with having kids at this moment, be careful. Somebody, yeah, somebody wants to have a family. What is this Wheel of Fortune? Oh my God, yeah. Happiness, Ten of Pentacles, like financial stability. A new beginning. A new beginning is coming in. I said um, um, you could have lots of options yeah there could be one in particular that has a lot of emotion for you with the devil the devil doesn't have to be anything bad 
it could be just like somebody just has like this crazy just love for you and there's a lot of competition right for whoever you are <laughs> so you know this person is like I, I have to I have to win I have to beat out this competition and they could be you know they, <laughs> they could be trying to end their competition secretly with this <laughs> I mean, it. I know it might sound bad, but I don't get it. That. Yeah. Okay. See, I don't get that it's bad. It's like I'm saying, somebody wants to have a home, a family. They want to build something. They want to have this new passionate beginning, and that's why they're they're strategizing. You know, so they're trying to take out their competition because they want to build. They want to have all this with you. They can see that with you and they understand that they have to make that love offer. Um, they might not know how to. They might not know how to, how to get to you. What's the advice for this group? Okay, what's the advice for this group? How can they move forward? Um, make the decision. <laughs> you could want to give a gift to them. Make a donation, maybe, to their job. Whatever they do, make a donation. This is Empress. just got this I don't know if you asked a question like this person is very much single um, you might think that there's a lot of people after this person but this person is like yeah no nah. you know it's almost like they they check people out before they they need to get clarity on them and then they make the judgment call so it's not like they're just, you know, welcoming whoever comes. They, they, they have their boundaries up to anybody who just comes at them. They're not trying to be reckless and bring, you know, carry on any burdens. So, yeah, I don't think this person is really involved with anyone. I don't know if that's something that you ask. Okay. Um... Anything else? Okay, this, yeah, this person is somebody who takes their time. Oh gosh. <laughs> this person takes their time when making decisions, right? Because they they've they might have lost before um, financially because of impulsive. decisions that they've made so this person that's why this person takes their time and yeah they're not just gonna charge forward into anything you know they're it's it's like they're not you know they've been disillusioned um, almost and they did they don't just they just don't fall for the same old, same old, you know, oh, uh, knight in, you know, my knight in shining armor, you know. They, they, they know that they have to take their time and really examine who they're getting involved in because they've gotten themselves into, yeah, a lot of the, all the knights are here. All the knights are here. And these two are very reckless and cruel. This one's supposed to be very loving, but when it's in reverse, it's like, yeah, these these knights have always charged in, act, act, 
acting like they're offering love, but being manipulative, being very cruel, being very um, sexually impulsive. And that's always left me in the cold. So I have lots of options and I'm going to examine all these cups very carefully before making a choice because I expect happiness and fulfillment from the relationship I invest in because you know this person might have a family and they don't want to bring burdens to this family right so they're looking for somebody who's very stable anything else yeah this this person will get um, clarity and cut out anything that doesn't serve see some of these cups you know they have love roses you know victory you know abundance and then there's others that have snakes and chaos so this person has to get clarity on which cup they choose because this is the this is the one that they're investing in to build this home life okay all right guys i think i'm gonna leave that there i hope this helped and don't forget to um, follow me on TikTok, Instagram, Facebook. You can also email me for your own personal readings if you are interested in that. And if not, we'll see you guys next time. All right, group number three. If you have the justice card, this is your reading. Okay, so let's see. Your, you got, your answer is yes, so let's see why your answer is is yes and why the justice card will you get justice in a situation okay we got the six of pentacles in reverse um one-sided charity okay one-sided charity so somebody could have been doing some work um, um, I'm getting doing some charity work it could have been in the justice system um, but this person was really giving 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 right to this person or to this um, cause if you will um, they could have been really they could have worked really hard doing this and this created a lot of jealousy and envy maybe in people in their workplace and then we have the king of cups so somebody could have been you know okay so even though there was a lot of jealousy um, this person put a lot of work into whatever it was that they were doing um, and that created a lot of envy jealousy in this work place but somebody sees value in it somebody's like hey you know I see yeah I just somebody sees value in it even though there's a lot of people around. That could be something that they're not saying. They might be hiding this. Okay. Um, then we have the Page of Pentacles. <clears throat> this is okay so whatever this person has been volunteering their time in they're you know they're new at this they don't know a whole lot about this um, this could this person could could been could have been having some some setbacks some delays maybe what is what is the world in reverse Some setbacks or delays um, maybe 
maybe this person, remember I said this person over here might see value in whatever this person has been doing, even though it's been causing some jealousy, some envy, you know, this person could also be a little bit of a workaholic, um, and other people don't <laughs> like that. So I'm, I'm almost getting like that envy, that jealousy could have been causing some rumors or things that were hidden in this community. But this person might make an offer. Maybe they're still trying to make up their minds about this. We got the Knight of Pentacles. Somebody's been very, you know, persistent and working hard. This person has been very reliable. This person has been very, okay, so very uh, loving and giving uh, when dealing with situations that were painful. These are, this talks, the Ten of Swords talks about painful endings. Could have been waiting for some res some results um, when it comes to this justice. Could be losing patience, maybe losing <laughs> losing just. I want to say kind of losing hope, maybe when it comes to this this situation. They have a lot of emotion for it, though. But it's like they kind of felt like they were having to like fight against too much. So with the temperance in reverse, it's almost like they're losing hope in the situation, and they're just gonna like, or like, all right, well, if this isn't for me, then I'll just move away to something I can do. I can do lots of things. I'll go find something else I'm passionate about. That might be a tower moment because this person is, you know, judgment. This person makes judgment calls. Yeah, they speak truth. They speak truths. Where, uh, where everybody acts like, oh, everything's cool, everything's fine, but it's really not. This person speaks truth, calls judgment, judgment on these situations, right? But because this person has been feeling like, you know, I've been alone in this, um, nobody really, you know, you know, it's one sided, you know, I'm giving, 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 but you know, I'm not getting anything it, from the situation. So this person's like, okay, I'm going to invest in something where I have a lot of passion for, where I have a lot of emotion for a situation. And that's going, going to bring balance in, you know, and it doesn't have to be in the justice system. I can, you know, I have lots of different things I can do. And so they're losing hope in this situation. They're like, you know what, this isn't going to work out. And that is going to be pretty devastating. It's going to be a, a devastating loss. That's what I'm getting for this hanged one. If you're still uh, unsure of how to, if you want to make this offer, that's what's, that's what it's saying. All right, guys, let's see, where are we at? Eight minutes? 
23 seconds. Okay, anything, any final message for this group? Final message for this group. Final message for this group. Cards are a little hard to shuffle. <laughs> so. Alright. Let's see. Any final advice or messages for this group? Final advice or messages for this group? God damn. Okay. Um. I'm not taking all of them, but I'll, I'll kind of go over what, okay. If the Ace of Pentacles in reverse, okay. If this offer is not made, Okay, so this person, we're talking about the person that you're thinking about, right? Yeah, it might be a little devastating, okay? So they were hoping this would bring um, some kind of stability where they've been juggling a lot, trying to work, giving to a situation that was one-sided. And this situation has caused nothing but stress and grief, okay? It's like you're, you're using my gifts and you're not even... You know, I'm not even getting any rewards. So there has been no communication. So this person's like, all right, you know, I'm not staying in this disappointment. I'm moving on. I'm cutting that out and I'm going towards my happy, right? You know, I'm not going to be sad. I'm taking a leap of faith somewhere else. Okay? That's what this person is saying. Now, we have the five of, the five of wands. Queen of Swords, Nine of Cups, the Page of Wands. Okay, so here, it's like this person is very, you know, this person has clarity. This person speaks truth. You know, um, there's a lot of competition for this person. They have many skills, and they can go towards anything that is their wish fulfillment like they they're you know there's m many different things that they can do and they're gonna do they're gonna go towards whatever they're most most passionate about when it comes to their work yeah they don't need to be they don't need to be stuck they won't be stuck so if this person <laughs> if this person walks away from you guys or from this group or from your company or whatever it is that you guys do it's gonna it's gonna be a, a, a painful uh, uh, I don't know, not painful or maybe a very disappointing realization but kind you know it's kind of like hindsight's 2020 20, right I didn't see that before had I seen it be had I seen what I if I knew what I was looking at, you know, when I was looking out, I wouldn't be in this state. I would have made an offer to join this community, but you didn't. And this person's like, I, I'll go, you know, I don't need to be here. I can build my, I can build my abundance somewhere else. I thought it could have been here calling judgment on these situations. But because it, it didn't come in, this person's just like, all right, well, that was disappointing. I guess I'm just going to take a chance somewhere else. All right, guys. I think I'm going to leave that there. I hope this brought you some clarity about your questions. And, yeah. Don't forget, you can check out my... Um, TikTok, Instagram, Facebook, also my email on how you can contact me for your own personal readings. 
is also down below in the description box. All right, guys. Again, thank you. Um, don't forget to like, share, subscribe, and we will see you guys next time.